What's wrong with the machines? Why has production stopped so abruptly? They've been acting wonky ever since yesterday night, and I guess today they've just finally stopped. Well, did you call someone to fix them? One of our machine experts, perhaps? We couldn't. And why couldn't you have? Because they're in the grinder. Those idiots fell in? No. You pushed them in. Because they made you mad, sir. Ah, oh, this is just perfect. Well, what about the intern? Do we have any interns that can do this? They all fled and ran once they found out what you did after getting mad. So we have no one to fix the machines? What a perfect Monday morning. You wouldn't be having this problem if you could control your anger. What was that? Nothing, sir. Mr. Darling, I have an intern here that's ready to meet you. I'm not in the mood to do an interview right now. Can't you tell? Ah, uh, I've already conducted the interview. They wanted to work on the machines we have here. Or at least that's the dog that they signed up for. An intern that's wanting to go into the machinery field? Hmm. Bringing them here. Right away, sir. So you must be them. You look scrawny for a person who wants to go into a field with heavy machinery. Since you're an intern, I may think of hiring you full-time, but I need to see what you're capable of. This machine stopped working this morning, and it was acting weird last night. Maybe if you can use your brain, you can probably fix... It? How... How did you do that? You fixed it so fast, so easily, like it was nothing. Huh? You completed college with a master's in the engineering field? Wow, I don't care. You've impressed me thus far. But don't get cocky. Since you fixed this machine so quickly, I expect each and every machine to follow suit and be at maximum potential. If I find a machine that's not working at said potential, I'll push you into the grinder and see what kind of color you'll make. <laughs>